Hey guys, I'm Reed. And I'm hey. Will. And we're here to show you the Roto Motion Mixer from Rosart. We're going to be making dinosaurs. In this pack, it basically what you do, you pour cast powder into a mold. You mix the cast powder with water, then you stir it around with, with the included spinner, and then it makes a dinosaur. You can see these, the packs included, the three molds, and then the mold spinner also includes a measuring cup, a knife thingamajigger, a stirrer, paint, and a sponge that you can use to paint it afterwards. In the expansion pack that we got, it has extra packs and a lot of different colors so you can cast a lot more. So, we're going to be unboxing these. I've got all mine open. I've got the powder included. We have the three molds that it comes with right here. We have the mixer itself. It comes in two parts and I'm assuming to snap it together like that. We have our miscellaneous tools that we're going to be using here. The knife, the stirring tool, the sponge. There's the other, there's the handle for it and everything else. Also includes the paint and a small paintbrush that you can use to paint the whatever, the dinosaurs once you're done molding it. And then last but not least, we have an instruction manual for those of you who want to use it. Hey guys, so like I said last time, we're going to be actually making one. So we already have one right here. It's the Triansaurus Rex. It's drying right now, so we're going to actually show you how to make it. So um, we're going to be having these paper towels on handy because in the instructions it says it's going to be pretty messy. So um, Will, go ahead and choose your mold. So I want to choose this one. This Triceratops. This is a good choice. It's a pretty cool one. So what, what you're going to do first, so we're going to set this, our choice aside right now. And what we're going to do, we're going to pick a color. So, so what you're going to do, you're going, there's a little bitty line in the pitcher right here. So you're going to take water, we have our water pitcher on handy right here. And you're going to pour it up to that line. Okay. Okay, hold this for you. It's going to be kind of messy, so got to be careful. Now I'm going to get our stirring tool ready. They provide this. So once you're done pouring in the powder wheel, I'm going to be stirring it with this little butter knife shaped thing. And it will mix the powder in with the water so it can good. actually work. Okay, that will work. So now we've got to stir this up like this. Pour the rest of it in, Will. Okay. Here. Put the rest in. There you go. Okay, so now we're going to stir this right here. Our tops here, and we're going to be putting him in our mold. And it's really easy to use, you just gotta put that in until you hear it snap, like you heard just now. And then while Will's stirring that, I'm gonna show you. See, it twirls around and it mixes it all the way. So we're gonna get it to where it's kind of facing up like this. Keep stirring it. And there's a little notch right here where you're going to pour the solution in. And then we're going to let it sit inside. So we're going to kind of double task here. And so, like, as we showed you, it twirls. So, so the mold might, like, be twirling around with the spinner thing. Right, now we're going to snap this shut and we're going to let it sit for a couple minutes so it can all get ready and stuff and so it's not going to leak. Will, what's yeah. your favorite dinosaur? Favorite dinosaur is the T-Rex. Yeah, it's, it's the T-Rex. That's a pretty awesome dinosaur. So make sure you guys subscribe to our channel and leave a comment below on what's your favorite dinosaur. A little bit big. So you're going to tear a piece of napkin about this big and you're going to put it right here. And you're going to then snap it shut. And this is so it doesn't like spill or anything yeah, just like while you're this doing one. it. This one, as you see, this one, in, yeah. 
And it doesn't spill. So we have our napkin in here now. And now for the fun part, we're going to be cranking it. That's the awesome. Let's do this for about two minutes. I think that's probably good for stirring. So now, but we're not done yet. We still have a little bit to wait because the plastic still needs to dry. So we're going to kind of turn that right there. Open it. Oh, um, I recommend putting a hand on it so that doesn't happen. So um, we're going to set this out to dry. It says it needs to dry for 15 minutes. This one is probably just about done throughout this video. It's been drying for, for a little while. So I think it's probably done. Yeah, I can feel it. It's pretty done. So what you're gonna do to get it done one going? Gonna can I open the cranks? these here just a sec. You're gonna open these things on the side like that. There's a little excess material, which is another reason you're gonna want paper towels. And so then I'm gonna set it down. Pull this open. Ah, it's a little bit tough, so you're probably gonna want like someone to help you with it. Yeah, can I? Can there I? There we open go. It? Okay. Ooh, that dinosaur. Good. Try to pop this out. There we go. Okay. Oh, this Look at looks it. awesome. Still a little bit wet, just kind of rubbery. And there's a little bottom part. I'm just going to snap that off so it can stand up. What are we Actually, th this is what the saw is for right here. So you can now we have our Tyrannosaurus Rex. Will, you want to feel it? Whoa. This is warm. Now for the next part. So I'm going to set our mixing stuff over here. And it's time to paint. Okay, so we have our T-Rex now. And we sawed off this ridge backbone and this little thing right here. We're going to be painting. So Will wants this color. So Will, what color, what do you want it to look like? I think it have like blue stripes on the back that could like... And on this one it has like... Like the tannish, whitish stuff for his belly, so you could see his arms more. Okay. Undo fast motion. Okay, well, that project went really well, won't you say so, Will? Yeah. We painted the Tyrannosaurus Rex, Rex Will, did most of the painting, and it looks pretty good. While we were doing that, my Triceratops came out, and it looks pretty amazing also. So, overall, this project's really good. I recommend it to anybody, because it's really easy to do. Even if you're not a big crafter, it's really fun and easy, and you get yeah. amazing results out of it. Yeah, I just gotta do one last bit of the belly. Okay, now this is the end of the video. See us next time.